<laughs> okay. Let me talk. Take let me, let me, let me somehow. Here. Well, this this round takes us home. Yeah. Um, this week we got to see a trailer for a new show coming to Amazon. Uh, I'm sorry, Prime Video, and it is called Secret Level. Um, the ma this is from the makers of Love Death Robots. If one thing on the show I've always said I love, I love anthology series like Twilight Zone, Outer Limits, shows like that. Love Death Robots is one of my favorite shows, and. To find out, this team was now going to be telling the story, anthology style, of 15 popular video game titles. Secret Level will have short stories based off of video game characters. What characters and properties are you talking about? I'm glad you asked. Warhammer 40K, Pac-Man, Concord, a game that's not even out yet. Mega Man, Unreal Tournament, New World, Armor Course, Spelunky, Honor of Kings, PlayStation titles like God of War, what? Jin Sakai from Ghost of Tsushima, Hell yeah. Dungeons and Dragons, The Outer World, Sifu, I am, oh, I'm sorry, did I, did I somehow not say Mega, Mega Man? Mega Man is so dope. God. This trailer blew me away that's armored core that we're watching right there but that is a mega man there are so many moments i'm pausing on this trailer to see everything they fit through spelunky in there a 2d side scrolling friggin' game just out of nowhere God. amazon has the money to pay for these licenses to put them in this form and i gotta admit from what i'm seeing right now knowing that it's the team from love death robots it looks fantastic it looks so good i am I am very trusting and hopeful going into this series. This is coming December 10th on Prime Video, and I need, I don't know, six, eight seasons of this show. Understand me, people. Some of you out there have always wanted your video game properties to be displayed in this type of format. The Warhammer community online, as, as I can read, needs some tranquilizer darts up in there. Them people are going ape. But for me, this is an opportunity, like, well, Core mentioned it, it in, to see a property on TV. It's a chance for Final Fantasy. It is a chance for Horizon to be seen. It is a chance, and this is from a marketing slash uh, production perspective, to gauge interest. Oh. Yeah. This I could be a jumping off point. For who knows how many franchises. Uncharted Nathan Drake story voiced by Nolan North. Do you hear me, doll? With a Nathan Drake that looks like Nathan Drake. Let's just move on from that. What? I, I what? Am, Not a little twink. I, I, I was... I, I had to, like, text Cora right away and put it in our chat. Like, y'all yeah. need to oh, see this sure. right now. I, the future looks... Very bright here. I, I'm trying to remain objective. Understand. I, you failed. Fifteen yeah. stories uh, is what we're expected to see. I, I, oh, I, had, oh, I had one of those like time slows down moments because I was looking at it and like a lot of these uh, properties I'm not crazy familiar with, but I saw a white face with a red stripe down it and time stopped and I was like, oh. They're going to do Pac-Man somehow. Yeah. Which Pac-Man Pac looks like some sort of character. weird android. Pac-Man is not a... I, I was talking about Kratos. I know that too. Yeah. Uh, and Kratos is in like New York, it looks like. He's in a city. What is going on here? I must yeah, know. Yeah, I went back and got a screenshot because I, I was obsessed. I, yeah, I had a, a collage of some of the things I was most Ooh. excited for. Um, I'm pretty sure Cora ran it, but I'm just like... No, I, I, I read the trailer. We, oh. Since we added the trailer, I yeah. didn't think Okay, fair enough. They were all there. Um... But, oh, Mega Man. Oh, man. Oh, sure. Mega the, Man, I grew up I mean, with Mega Man. I love Mega But, Man. honestly, this Mega is Man a natural is progression. Any other game. This was a natural progression after Nintendo had such success with Super Mario Brothers. Yeah. Of course. And how and the, the success that the Sonic movies had. Oh, yeah. absolutely. Yeah. And the Knuckles show. Don't We can't forget those. Which a lot of this stuff's over at Paramount. So, they'll Which, probably be very selective with some of the PlayStation licenses. Especially with some of the movie properties like or Need Sega. for Speed and Sega and Sega. Yeah. So, um, oh, just get all. How far back can we go? This, so 
I wanted to say, cause I was going to say this before the show, but I figured it would be better here. Based on what they were saying in the trailer, which, by the way, go watch the, the actual trailer because there is sure. overarching commentary, of course, over it. It's giving, like, a more, a different take on Captain N, the Game Master. Ooh, because he ooh, said, um, you took it back, girl. Cause, like, and it may be because I don't recognize the game that it's from, but when he says, like, your game is waiting, he's handing him a gauntlet. Yes. Yeah. And in Captain N, he had the gauntlet from the... The, the Power Glove. The, any, thank you. The Power Glove from the NES. So it, it seems like maybe it's... That's a similar direction they may be taking it. Obviously, Captain N was very different because it was one only Nintendo properties. But... We actually have an interview on our channel with the voice actor that played Captain N. Yeah. Yeah. It was, I don't know how I it was that. surprisingly at Brony Fest. He just happened to be there and I brought it up. That was his first acting gig. Oh, wow. Yeah. But okay. this show, the potential is so high. The, the sky is the limit. If they can make this work, and I believe, I believe they can make this work. Yeah. If, if nothing else, it'll be visually stunning, and you know what? At least we've got that. What platform? Uh, Prime. Which, who has the money? Like you mentioned, like licenses. How do they get they, yeah. they, this? There's some money being shelled out here, and it's Prime. And they would have had to get some of these licenses already because, yeah. Do you think this is why, one, or one of the reasons the Warhammer show got canceled? I don't I th think so. I think they might have backed it up to be like, let's see what kind of buzz yeah. we get. I'm all I'm yeah. all about what Cass said earlier, gauging interest. Yeah. I think if this show was a, is a success, we're probably going to see the next boom of and these properties. And it's of these no properties. secret that the God of War TV show has been in production hell for a while. Yeah, mm -hmm. like live casting, not with uh, Chris Pratt. Yeah, we're still able to tell these short stories, but yeah. Uh, December 10th, Clear my schedule. I'm I'm down. You can binge watch. Uh, you can binge watch all of uh, Secret Level, and then you can go watch the Sonic movie later that month because oh. Sonic Three is coming out this month or not this month. Wow, I wish. Yeah, you, this, year. yeah. this year. This this is gonna be a nice Christmas present for me. So yeah, check out Secret Level. 